All I had was to stand tight and manage. I shall remember that next time you quarrel with me. Considering how very handsome you are, you seem a little occupied with it. Crazy little renegade. I have made a match between Mr. Knightley and Jane Fairfax. Mr. Knightley and Jane Fairfax. Right when I thought my days were done, you showed the sun to me. If it wasn't for you, I'd always be in and out of love, flying in the I should like to see Emma in love, and in some doubt of a return. And it wasn't quite enough, I'm trying hard to say that even if I I must tell you. Emma, what you will not ask, though I may wish it unsaid the next moment. Then do not speak it. And always be in and out and in and out of love. As a friend, I will hear whatever you like. As a friend, Emma, that I fear is a word. Tell me, Emma, have I no chance of ever succeeding? You think of Mr. Knightley for yourself. Harry. I, I do not flatter myself with any idea of his attachment to me. You will always be my dearest, most beloved, and tell me at once. Done indeed. And knowing it wasn't quite enough, I'm I cannot make speeches. Say that yeah. even if I never but if I loved you less, then I might be able to talk about it more. You. And always be in and out, and in and out of love.